Hi, it's Steve from Custom Table Tennis and we're just going to review a couple of our best selling bats. We've just been asked uh, what are our best two selling offensive blades and people are having trouble deciding. So we're just going to do a short review. So the first one is our is our own brand um, these, these are going out quite regularly we've just done a trade stand um, for those on the for these on the day with the rubbers um, the blade it's a carbon blade so it's carbon offensive so you can see the carbon layers in there it's got a Kiri core and a Koto outer so it's quite a hard fast stiff blade it marries up very very well with the Euro DF rubber, the Exium Vega Euro DF. Uh, weight wise, one fifty eight. So it's quite a light bat. If I just show you the blade without the rubbers, you'll see why. Because uh, more and more players are wanting lighter and lighter. We says we want. Even our carbon, we wanted it around about 75 grams instead of the usual um, 85, just to keep the weight down. So we've got 75 on that one. We get plus or minus uh, three, so you might get ones a little bit heavier. It's very difficult to get the exact weight every single time. One of the reasons it goes out and, and does well is because the quali quality and the finish. Um, our logo is always flush so i wouldn't say it's a budget bat but we sell a lot of them because it's a very very good price you can you can basically get this bat with the two rubbers on for the price of two rubbers on other branded stuff so that's that one so i'll move along to our well this is this is probably sells uh, just about the same even though it's a different price point it's a different thing altogether it's a wood nut blade it's the offensive version. This one's got a balsa core, mahogany outer. Same rubber again. We'll just have a look at the weight. Very light. The reason being um, balsa core instead of kiri. So we'll just have a look at one of these with a balsa core and you'll see the weight is extraordinary extraordinary light we've had we've had them even lighter depending on the handle that you choose the, can, the weight can go up and down um, ours by the way we've just got them in the flared at the moment because flared nine times out of ten players are using flared um, just quickly but I'm going to do another video about this but I just want to quickly just touch on this somebody asked what's the white lightest bat we can provide um, this is a popular branded one. We sell loads of these. Um, been around a long time. The black version is the anniversary model. Yeah, they're around about 75. They, they, they vary quite a bit on the weights. Uh, the balsa is set vertical. You see also, um, it's not in one piece. It's in lots of little pieces. You can see the variation uh, there. So all the wood nut blades, you, you've seen the videos before, but they're all in one piece. So if I have a look at one of our lighter ones, we've just made this for somebody. He says, can you make a sub 60? I said, the lightest one that we've ever made is 53 grams. And he says, well, I'll be happy under under 60. Um, we, we've chosen the anatomic handle because this brings the weight down a little bit. This is going out today, 58. So he said he under 60, 58. Um, it's a bit of a struggle to get them down to 52, 53. Uh, this is the cherry, which is the lightest wood. So it's got the cherry handle, cherry top, balsa core, beautifully finished. Made in England, made in Yorkshire. Fantastic blades. So just a little quick review just to answer questions. And we're going to start doing more reviews uh, and get a little bit more in depth. But this is just a taster. Until the next video. Bye for now.